Come on, Richard. That's Larry Charlie's here. Alright, let's start. Tell us about yourself. I'm Ricciardi, I'm 18 and I'm a filmmaker and uh, in my spare time I, uh, you know, it's, I, I like to do charity work, it's, it's not a big deal or anything, I'm just, I'm just a really great person really. Um, what work do you do? Uh, yeah, I like to give money to homeless, you know, th they need it, it and it makes me look great, so. Alright guys, we're about to commit some charity. What the fuck? I'm not even homeless. You look it. So what made you get into films? Well, so when I was a kid, I loved films, and uh, I, I made one to sell around my school, but uh, that stupid teacher told me to stop selling it, so I was like, shut up, bitch, you can't repress my creativity. Uh, I'm, I'm on the grind. Like, you know, ever since standing up for my, myself like that, I've known I can get it in this business. So do you have any hobbies? Yeah, I do a lot of charity. charity. Yeah, I'm kind of a gamer. So what films inspired your style? I think the biggest one for me would be Groundhog Day. You know, it's everything in it is masterful, perfection, but my stuff's even more perfect. But, you, you know, sometimes you just got to lower yourself to a bit more of a humble level and encourage the amateurs a bit. Are there any others? No other films are really on my level. So what type of films did you make? When I was a kid, I uh, started off with Lego stop motion, but as I matured, I moved on into, you know, live action. And uh, ever since then, I've been writing scripts with my, by myself or with friends. But, but even at one point, I planned a uh, Infinity War parody before the film even came out, because I'm, I'm that smart. But, you know, whenever writing scripts, it was always whether it was myself or with other people, my parts were always the best, unrivaled scripts. So what are your future plans? I think my films are gonna shape the industry. They're gonna afford the human race. My Corpse Kiwi Studios are gonna be the turning point in our existence. I mean, my short films, my skits, my music videos, they're all gonna be looked back on and people are just gonna talk about how they were just the pinnacle of art and just the reason humanity just continued to exist into the future. It's going to cure all the problems.